The new patriotic party is saying it is surprised by the Electoral Commission's decision to implement the representation of the People's Amendment Law, that's Ropal, in the 2020 elections. A High Court ruling in 2017 directed the Electoral Commission to ensure that steps are taken to roll out the Ropal Director of Research and Elections of the new Patriotic Party. Evans Nemakon, in an interview with TV3, said although the Electoral Commission's decision comes to them as a surprise, they are ready to comply if it takes place. For us as New Patriotic Party, we are aware that the EEC has put together uh, an IPA consultative committee uh, to consult with Ghanaians living abroad to see and other stakeholders to see how best the ROPA can be implemented in, in the future. So we, we are yet to be informed on the conclusion of the committee's uh, work. I'm aware that the committee, and I was lucky to be part of the committee that went to United States of America, and I'm aware that the committee is yet to visit Europe to consult with Ghanaians uh, in Europe. So uh, it's coming to us as a surprise. We will wait and find out from the EC whether, uh, whether the conclusion of the consultative body, they will still want to go out. But I'm aware of the High Court ruling that the, the EC must ensure that the, the law is implemented to the latter. The new Patriotic Party is a national party. We also have branches across the borders of Ghana. We've been mobilizing our members, we've been engaging our members outside of Ghana. In fact, if you, you care to know, the new Patriotic Party has about 22 external branches. The party is organized from polling station level up to national and to the diaspora. So we engage our membership. Again, the new Patriotic Party is a law-abiding party. If the, it's in the law and the EC want to go along it, the party will strategize and win out of the arrangement.